The Yankton boys basketball team opened 2020 with a loss against O'Gorman, but has posted five straight wins since, including victories against Lincoln and Washington. Tonight, the top-ranked Bucks completed their tour of Sioux Falls at Roosevelt. Opening minutes, Yankton senior Cooper Corneman bounces to Hunter Katros. The 6'10 senior banks through two, giving the Bucks an early advantage. On the far end of the floor, the Riders' Jackson McCormick dishes to Michael Paulson. Junior guard hits for three, ending the Bucks 6-0 run. Second quarter, Yankton adds to its three-point lead. Matthew Moores dribbles into the paint, leans and scores, and the foul. And Yankton outlasts Roosevelt 47-46. Lincoln looked to complete a regular season sweep of rival Washington. Fourth quarter, the Warriors add to their two-point advantage. Gannon Thompson gives it up, gets it back, and gets the shooter's roll. He had a team-high 16 points, 35-30. Later in the fourth, Lincoln trails by three until Maxwell Burchill dribbles up top and buries a triple. He had a game-high 25 points, were tied at 40. But with under two minutes to play, tied at 42, Thompson spots Dagan Schramm, who connects from the corner for three. And Washington outlasts Lincoln 48-46. A top five showdown in Class A featuring Sioux Falls Christian and Dakota Valley. First quarter, the Chargers get off to a hot start, working the ball to Xavier Van Beek, who buries a corner three. He had 21 points. Sioux Falls Christian leads 11-7. Later in the first, the Panthers trail by four until Paul Bruns powers through two defenders, bucket and the foul. He tallied a team-high 25. Ahead of the third quarter, Chargers by 26 and counting. Two quick passes lead to a one-handed slam by Zach Witte. Senior scored a game-high 27 points. Sioux Falls Christian wins its third straight, 84-53. A girls basketball game pitting fourth ranked Lincoln against Washington. Opening quarter trailing by one, the Patriots work the ball inside to Morgan Hansen. The USD commit spins and scores with the left hand. Lincoln leads 10-9. Moments later, the Warriors work the block. Sidney Shetnan banks through two and the foul, and Washington leads by one. Second quarter, Washington by four, but Lincoln gets a bucket back. Hansen hits Emma Osmondson, who splits two defenders, scoops through two. She had nine straight in the second half, and Lincoln earns a 63-55 win over Washington. A Class A contest featuring Sioux Falls Christian and Dakota Valley. First quarter trailing by a pair, the Chargers' Kyla Van Donkers good finds a cutting Maddie DeYoung, who lays in two of her team-high 16 points. We're tied at seven. Later in the first, Panthers by two, and they add two more. Peyton Tritz has her shot blocked, but Riley Rosenquist there for the bucket. She had a game-high 20 points. Ahead of the third quarter, Dakota Valley trails by one, but Rosenquist drives and kicks to Grace Bass, who sinks two of her 10 points. Dakota Valley earns a 51-43 win.